I got all my traveling out of the way, been out of state a couple times, and now it's time to get back home to South Mississippi and try to get one of these Mississippi bucks on the ground. Now, I don't know what's going on this year, but there's obviously a struggle in finding a mature buck to take. And I don't know if it's all these hogs that have come in that have ran the deer off or what, but for some reason, I'm having a problem finding me a buck to shoot. Now, we finally got a couple bucks showing up on the coverts at a stand that we don't hunt a whole lot. So I decided I'm gonna give it a shot. So I get up in the stand, get settled in, and I'm watching the Buckbuster seed plot and just expecting something to step out any minute. And I look back behind me and I see, the, see a buck coming through the cutover. At the camp in Mississippi, we got a big old, I believe it's a six point, possibly a seven point. I couldn't see the right side all that well. It looks a lot like the one I shot two years ago out here. That's awesome. Can't believe it. It all came down right here. It's been a struggle for us here in Mississippi and Illinois and everywhere. It's just been a struggle this season. And finally come home and shoot one. Man, it's just awesome. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for that one. Day after Christmas, it is 70 something degrees. Ridiculous. When he started going up the hill over here on the other side, that's when I, I get, it got serious quick. All right, just got out on stamp and go look for this deer. He should be right here. I don't think he went too far. I was worried that I wasn't gonna get a shot at a deer before we went to ATA. Thank the Lord, thank the Lord. He sent me one. You get over there and there's not a whole lot of blood and I, I see leg bone, so I'm getting a little nervous at this point because I've already been about 60 yards in the woods and I'm having trouble finding the blood. So I decided to back out and call our buddies at Mississippi Blood Trailing Network. And uh, sure enough, we get on the trail and uh, we're going down through there and I hear him say he's on it. Oh yeah. Oh boy, here we go. We got him. Well, thank the good Lord we found him. This is a, I don't think I've seen pictures of this deer on the trail camera, but a couple of the guys in the camp say they've seen him. And it's just a deer that we need to take out of the herd. Anytime you got a, a six point like this, that's all he's ever gonna be. He was the same thing last year and it's not gonna get any better. So we're grateful to get this deer out of the herd. And uh, thank the good Lord we found him. Our boys, Kyle and Stuart uh, came out and brought the dog out, Riddick. Is that the dog's name? Yes, sir, that's it. Brought Riddick out to look for this deer and I can't say enough about the work that they do helping hunters find 
their deer that uh, they may have met a poor shot on or just have uh, some questions about if it's a good shot or not, call Kyle and Stuart and uh, they will help you out for I sure. I think we've took right at, uh, I think we've took 51 or 52 tracks this evening and we've recovered. This will be number 31 or 32. We'll have to look at the track log real quick, but uh, right now as it stands, good, <laughs> we'd, <laughs> thank goodness Brooke made a pretty good shot with it though, but we had bone to start with and uh, right now that we we come here with 35 straight bone leg shot recoveries and we're going to end tonight with number 36. So we appreciate the, uh, appreciate y'all going in. Y'all did the right thing too and, and seeing that bone immediately and, and marking it and backing out and not jumping that deer, but we need to get on those deer on that first jump if we can get those, you know, normal we uh we're able to get in there and get the deer bait up and get it dispatched and whatever we need to do but did everything right bro we sure appreciate it buddy yes sir how do the people get a hold to you uh they can reach me directly by phone at 601-441-0738 or they can go find us online on social media at uh mississippi blood trailer network.com all righty we appreciate you boys. thank you bro appreciate it yes, sir. now i'm thankful that these guys came out and helped me find my deer well, I'm Brooke with Real South Hunting, and I want to tell you thank you for watching the show. And I want to tell you how you can keep up with us in real time. If you'll go to our Facebook page, give us a like. If you'll go to our Instagram and give us a follow, that will let you keep up with us as things are happening. You can also go to realsouthhunting.com. You can check out some of our content on there. You can also purchase a hat there in our online store. We have over 30 different styles and colors. Each purchase helps us create the content that you're seeing now. We appreciate you watching the show and we appreciate each and every one of you that go out there and buy a hat to show support for Real South Hunting.